So it's IFR, I'm at an uncontrolled pilot control airport, how am I going to get out of here? Welcome to the Safer Pilot Challenge. What is happening, M Zero Online Ground School? Jason here with my best co-pilots in the world. Ellie, you want to say hi to everybody? Hi. Gavin, you want to say hi to everybody? Hi. Hey, look at them. I mean, they're they're. Who's going to be the best pilot? Me. Me. I think they both think they're going to be the best pilot. So, anyways, hey, we need to depart from Tampa Executive. I diverted again to Tampa Executive, believe it or not. And we need to do it IFR. How are we going to end up doing that? Well, we're going to call Tampa Approach here on the ground to pick that up. But before we do that, let me fast forward a little bit. I need to get everything ready. My run-up done, everything else all set and done. So when I'm ready, I call Approach when I am number one. So Coach Ray, I'll fast forward this real quick while I do my run-up, and we'll be ready to go here on the other side. All right, so we're back here, and I want to show you something, too. Not only with it being, and again, the, the field's not IFR, but I would get in the, in the soup here pretty soon, as you can see. And also, if you look at the iPad, we're kind of buried under some Bravo here, depending on how we're departing. We're actually going to depart out of here, runway 5, so you can see what that looks like. You know, Bravo starts at 3,000 feet here. If you're taking off at 2-3, you're really going to get thrown into it quickly with a 1,200-foot shelf there. So just these are some things you got to watch for. So what's going to happen is we're going to switch on over to Tampa. I might get a scratch pad ready. We're heading to Staples. I don't see much. Don't know my route. Either, I maintain blank. Expect blank. One zero minutes. Departure frequency is her at nine nine. And my squat code. And listen to how the radio calls a little bit different. Tampa Sierra's five one five Sierra Charlie on the ground at Tampa Exec IFR to Naples. November 515 Sierra Charlie, Tampa. Hold for release to Clay to Naples via rotor vectors to. Actually, your routing's not good. But we're going to put Sexton in there. So 5 Sierra Charlie. It's going to be rotor vectors Sexton. That's Charlie, Echo, X ray, Alpha, November, and then Naples. And our controlled airspace heading 090, climbing team 1600. Expect 9,000 as a final. Departures 119 or point niner, and your squawk is 4752. Hold for release. Go ahead with your readback. Clear Naples, radar vector Sexton uh, 090 on departure will be off of runway 5. It's uh, up to 1600. Expect 9,010 minutes after. Talking to you on 199 and 4752. We'll be ready to go in about two minutes off of runway 5. Okay, uh, 5 Sierra Charlie, you're released now. Your clearance is void in seven minutes. If you're not airborne in seven minutes, advise me of your intentions. Understand clearance void, if not airborne in seven minutes, 515 Sierra Charlie. That is why you get your run-up done ahead of time. Five, three, Bravo Alpha. I switch it back over real quick. Now i got to move fast. i got seven minutes. I need to go claim my spot as number one here real quick, which I probably should have done earlier. Waiting there. Four, seven, five, two. She wants me on a, a zero, nine, zero on the way out up to 1,600. All that's good, good. Radar vectors Sexton, C-E-X-A-N. We'll get that up there. She's gonna give me radar vectors to it. Now I'm back on with Unicom. Tampa exec, ready check. Tampa executive traffic, Sierra 515, Sierra Charlie, uh, departing runway five to the east, Tampa exec. I know I'm heading to the east, because that's what she told me. Still checking, I'm clear. All is good, Ellen, Gavin, you're buckled. All right, thank you. We're going to pull out on five. Do you see how quickly all that happened, though? She only gave me seven minutes. you got to have all, all your stuff ready to roll. Looks good. Looks good. And here we go. Airspeed's alive. Engine cage is confirmed. Green, green, green. This is the plane where the fuel came out of the wing that Ella spotted, so I'm always looking at that fuel cap. Here comes Rotate. We're up and flying. Good little wind. Tampa exec 
traffic, that's a 64823, four miles to the northeast of the field, and bound for the 45 left down, number 5. Damage Blocks coming up. All's looking good. Climbing on out nice. All right, coming up, 600 feet. Caps available, flaps confirm up, everything's set. Tampa Executive Traffic, here's 515 Sierra Charlie, uh, departing the area to the east, last call Tampa Executive. I like to announce it's my last Tampa call, I'm on my way out. Four, eight, two, three, flip flop on over. Tampa Roach, here's 515 Sierra Charlie, 800, climb 1600. Five one five zero Charlie, I didn't climb maintain four thousand. I got up to four thousand we're heading zero nine or zero. Five one five zero Charlie. Five one five zero Charlie, Roger, thank you for that. Turn right heading one eight zero. Right turn one eight zero, five one five zero Charlie. Air two seven eight Romeo contact Miami Center one two. I should probably put the autopilot on too. I'm hand flying this thing. All these changes and everything else, but a lot of fun. Air five zero Charlie, climb maintain nine thousand. Up to nine thousand now, five one five zero Charlie. So long story of how I ended up in Tampa Exec, we had to divert because of weather and everything else too. That'll be a separate video perhaps in the future, but it's looking much, much better weather-wise. There's my 180. So what'd you think? Departing IFR out of an uncontrolled pack on Twitter. There's other ways to do it, by the way, I could have gotten into. There's RCOs, uh, GCOs, Remote Communications Outlet, Ground Communications Outlet, you could do there as well. It's not just call an approach on the ground. It's the easiest way to do it. Ellen, yeah, did you learn something? They're, they're giving me looks back there. Listen, hope you learned something. Leave me a comment down below in this video um, on uh, on YouTube, on Facebook. And again, check out the online ground school, m0atrial.com. Have a blessed, abundant, outstanding rest of your day. And most importantly, remember, the good pilot is always learning. Have a great day, everybody. I'll see ya.